so startled right now. I think, I think I may have stumbled across. Uh. While alone in the woods, a YouTuber named Christina Roberts sets her sights on two mysterious creatures she has never seen before. They look to be covered in fur and appear to walk upright as they spread out to cover more ground. At 30 seconds, one turns to reveal a broad, hairy back and may even be carrying one of its offspring. The two creatures are caught on Christina's camera, but they don't detect her because she is wearing camouflage and quietly whispering to herself out of view. They sit down in a clearing and she uses the opportunity to sneak away. I personally think creatures look to be about normal size and could just be people in gorilla suits. Hundreds of people have left comments agreeing that this is one of the scariest forest creature videos they've ever seen. So I guess I could be wrong. Tell me what you see. This rare footage of a sewer monster is brief, but frightening. The video seems to capture a glimpse of something large with a tail launching around the underground. The black and white adds to the creepiness of the footage when suddenly something the size of a kangaroo moves swiftly past and out of sight. Although not quite as unsettling in movement as a creepy critter might be, whatever this strange being is, it looks completely out of place in the sewage system. Any idea what this strange creature could be? Uday Hindi is exploring an old building when he comes across a little girl staring at him from the corner of the room. <laughs> The door furthest away from both of them shuts all by itself before he gets a chance to investigate. Despite this, Uday Hindi bravely pushes into the next room and discovers she is not a girl, but rather a creepy life-size doll. He roughly handles the doll from room to room and throws it on the floor, and that's when the doll decides it's had enough. <laughs> I saw no strings when the doll moved, did you? Anyway, he is busy analyzing some strange and possibly demonic markings on the doll when suddenly this happens. Watch and try and translate what he says shortly before it goes all wrong. <laughs> This part I feel like could have been from the way the doll was leaning on the wall before it fell, but the incident before that I feel could be quite real. Every child has an imaginary friend, but this one is not so imaginary. Posted to TikTok by Alkakoi.tv, a father enters his daughter's room around 7 p.m. as she laughs uncontrollably with someone. As the father rounds the corner, he says his daughter's name. Then he spots this figure peering out from behind her. He rushes over to find no one there, and his daughter looks as though she's in a trance that he can't shake her out of. What is going on here? While many in the comments admit this is too creepy, commenter X Gamer. Mama X sums up my feelings. She writes, Well, I won't be sleeping today. Hey, me. Hey, me. A parenting channel called The Mommy Wayopedia has thousands of subscribers who are looking for heartwarming family videos. Paranormal content is not what they seek, and I don't think she's playing around when she uploaded a rather realistic ghost sighting video for fans to analyze. So here's the background story on this video. She's been seeing some weird things on CCTV camera for the past week or so, but never had the phone nearby to record. and does have a memory card for the camera, so she waited near the CCTV monitor for a couple of days for the paranormal entity to return, and this creepy sighting of a mysterious figure is what she has since caught on camera. The mother tries to keep the fear out of her voice as she tells her son to keep reading a book out loud. Oh. Oh, I hear you read the book, baby. Okay. She doesn't want to scare him. She can't take her eyes off what she sees. Seated on the ground facing the courtyard on the first floor is this exquisitely eerie ghost sighting. A woman with long hair and a gown. 
She's across from the main entrance waiting for them to come out. The see-through figure does not move, but look closely and at 10 seconds, you'll see this object across from the ghost is moving all by itself. Or maybe it's the wind. The mommy Wayopedia has no idea what this ghost wants from her or her family and is seeking advice on what to do next. I would say this is a camera glitch, but she's been seeing it on different monitors across different places, so it appears to be an actual ghost. With that in mind, the only thing left to do is either confront it or hope it goes away, and I'm not sure if either is going to get her any peace. A Twitter user named Kazuki Sake is visiting a graveyard in Japan. When he claims this pebble broke off a statue and went into a frenzy, try and translate this part into English if you can. <laughs> so what do you think is going on here? This could be an actual ghost, CGI, or maybe even just a pebble on a string. Matt Bell accidentally manages to catch his neighbor's house on video as it goes up in flames. Watch about a minute in as a flaming piece of debris flutters across the street and lands in his hedges with a solid thud. Soon his front yard is ablaze, and now Matt's house looks like it is about to go up next. It looks pretty bad for a while, until his neighbors run over with some garden hoses and work on putting out the flames. Meanwhile, all Matt can do is watch on his phone with terror as he rushes home. Please put that out for me, please. I'm on my way home. Your house on fire! Yeah, I know. I'm on my way. The authorities are ultimately able to contain the blaze and keep it from spreading to other residences. This video just goes to show how easily the fire could have spread. If that flaming chunk had landed on Matt's roof instead of the hedges, there would have been little that his neighbors could have done. Meteors keep flying over Japan, and they keep getting weirder each time. This relatively normal one, spotted in February of 2013, looks to be on a downward course until it burns up in the atmosphere at the last second. Then, just one year later, another one manages to get even closer, this time piercing a cloud. Children's Camp What ghost haunts this creepy former children's camp? Is it that of a former counselor? Or a former camper? Dennis from the YouTube channel Dark Ghost Paranormal explores, and he quickly discovers that whoever it is, it's certainly angry. When Dennis goes to check it out, he is frightened away. As he enters the room, he finds someone is in there. And the eeriness continues. The voice, the running, the dragging, the mayhem. It sounds like the ghost of a child to me. And this active child spirit is now running the camp. Number 20. A YouTuber named Shenen Sarmi is excited to travel to California, but far less enthusiastic about her flight, specifically her window, which is not sitting in place and makes this unsettling noise. Well, going through the window and I didn't tell anyone. By the time she lands, the first of the two layers of glass has slid down enough to poke her finger through. It looks like she is sticking her hand out of the plane, but she actually isn't. There is one more layer of glass that is hard to see, but still, the thickness of the window is now halved. She notices something was wrong with her window during the flight, but did not tell anyone until the very end, not wanting to cause a panic. 
I see where she is coming from, and she might have just been too shy and scared to speak up, but I personally think she should have said something because they might have needed to make an emergency landing to fix it. She was trying to keep everyone calm by not telling, but looking at the condition of the window, I think it could have put everyone's lives in danger. But above all else, I'm just glad that she and everyone else was okay. A TikToker named Heck Aiden is dancing in her room with the door closed when it somehow pushes open by itself and no one steps in. Like I said, the door looks fully closed and there's no visible gaps in the doorway to indicate that it was partially left open as part of a skit. The doorknob doesn't seem to turn either, so as far as I'm concerned, there should be no way for it to open like that. Heck Aiden tries to play it off and finishes her video, but the more she reflects on it, the more she seems convinced that this was a ghost after all. Captured by a ring camera, Redditor Hematospermia's neighbors woke up to this at 5am on Sunday morning. First off, that mask is terrifying. Secondly, this masked intruder is not alone. I'm not sure why they're blocking the camera when they're already wearing masks, but obviously their intentions are nefarious, and this is soon confirmed by what they're carrying. The camera is blocked for the duration of the video, and there is no sound or explanation from the Redditor, so unfortunately, I don't know how this standoff ended, and this has left Redditors guessing. I too hope this is a viral marketing campaign, but I have a feeling it's all too real. Every day this YouTuber has a neighbor challenge him to come outside of his apartment to settle an imaginary score. Just to be completely clear, these people have never interacted before. This still doesn't stop her from bothering him outside of his door almost every day. At times it seems as if she imagines an answer from him. Like this part for example. I think she hears something in her own mind, tells him to try it, and then hears another response that never happened. Perhaps weirdest of all is how the videos are dated throughout November and December, yet she always appears to be wearing the same outfit. Perhaps she is past the point of keeping basic hygiene habits and needs to be taken somewhere safe that can care for her. In the meantime, I hope she gets the help she needs. Here's a video that shows how Randonautica can be scary without even trying. A YouTuber named Nolan goes randonauting with his friends in search of the color orange. The app takes them to two orange cones, no problem. Do you see that? Cones. Orange cones. <gasps> no way. They are weirded out but not entirely convinced, so they decide to go randonauting for something more obscure that would be creepier to find, like the number four. So we're doing a number? Yeah, okay. So Four. Not only do they find the number four prominently etched into a concrete handrail, but get this, the location that's given to them to find the number four. It's four minutes away is exactly four minutes away. Now they are getting creeped out and concentrate on a color that's hard to find in the countryside at night. The color blue. Not only does Randonautica take them to a pack of blue gum, when they go back to their car, they find out they were parked by an empty energy drink with blue lettering this whole time. A YouTube channel called Jaeger Expective is partying at a rental home they soon suspect is haunted after running some experiments. According to them, these motion activated lights don't turn on unless someone is in the room, yet the lights come on here when the room is empty. Isn't 
not censored. I think the lights might turn on whenever the door opens though, because when you watch it again, that's pretty much exactly what happens. So they could be wrong about the lights, but next they hear a faint sound from far away. It sounds like one of those really old fashioned phones that used to have an actual bell on top. Uh, everybody has their phones, right? <laughs> Everyone decides to talk about it again in the morning and they go to bed, or at least they try. Strange sounds continue throughout the night, Stuff that's hard to catch on camera, like a single footstep and nothing else. In the morning, they all still have a bad feeling and feel what they describe as a chilly vibe permeating every room. Jaeger does a quick recording of every room in the house and picks up this figure, which I think could just be his reflection in a mirror, or maybe not. This video is creepy and I'll get to the scary part, but first I want to know what language is being spoken and what they are saying here. I'm guessing he's asking who's there. Unfortunately for him, this strange sighting is his answer. A person comes walking out backwards in a painfully high arch that even a gymnast would struggle to achieve. It's like a scene out of one of the exorcism movies, but is it real? It almost seems too weird to be real, but how many people do you know who can move like that? Then again, they are at a gym, so maybe they are in good shape and one of his more athletic friends was able to fake this back-breaking pose. This video of a mysterious creature was published to YouTube by Real Ghost Official 007 in December of 2019. The video, taken in the lot of a gas station, shows a slender, spindly limbed creature standing on two legs. It is momentarily caught by the headlights of a passing vehicle before it darts off out of sight. It looks somewhat similar to the creature in a TikTok video that's coming up on this list. Perhaps it's of the same mysterious breed. It makes sense to me, but I guess it could be something else altogether. Do you have any other explanations? It's enough to keep me indoors. This CCTV video captures a large figure lurking beneath a bush on an empty street. It's hard to tell what it is at first until the camera zooms in for a better look. Some kind of humanoid is low to the ground, as if waiting to grab someone, anyone who walks by. It looks like it could be a person until it dips its head from the shadows at 1 minute and 58 seconds to reveal an upsettingly long face with large, gnashing jaws. The way it repeatedly moves side to side looks like it's probably just a looping animated sequence. But what's your take? Mature footage was shot somewhere in an underground sewage system. The cameraman is presumably a maintenance worker who is wearing a chest cam. Little did he expect to find a humanoid down there with him. The video begins with the cameraman seemingly frozen in place. The camera is very still as if the maintenance worker is too afraid to move. Maybe he heard a noise and is waiting for a creature to reveal itself. Suddenly a pair of floating eyes peer at him from the distance. The eyes appear to belong to some sort of nocturnal predator. They reflect so much light that all you can see are two gigantic white dots that are roughly as wide around as flashlights. The humanoid does not appear to have much experience with humans and seems apprehensive as it peers around the corner. It decides to run away and the cheap camera cuts out before we can see any more of the chase. The creature seems incredibly fast and probably got away, but exactly what happened next is anyone's guess. The video footage survived, so the cameraman probably did as well. Then again, maybe they recovered it from his dead body instead. There's just not enough information out there to say for sure. Don't look behind you. This scary video is trending in the Arabic-speaking YouTube community. After witnessing something terrifying, this man flees to his car, but that something is there waiting for him. <laughs> the creepy video, originally posted to TikTok by TV, also reveals what initially scared the man. Stay. 
But as we already know how it ends, the man clearly has nowhere to run and nowhere to hide. If I were him, I'd be getting the heck out of that house ASAP. Thank you so much for getting me to 50,000 subscribers here on my Clips channel. If you want to support, please press that subscribe button. Let's get to 60,000 subscribers next. Thank you.